Good morning and welcome to King of Glory Lutheran Church. It's good to be here together to worship the Lord today. Uh, a couple announcements on the back of the bulletin. Uh, you'll see uh, Tuesday at 6.30, we're having another logo work group meeting. So if you uh, want to share any inputs or opinions on, the, uh, on future changes to our church logo, that's the place to come and share those as they work towards searching for a new logo. Uh, otherwise, you'll see our regular weekly events scheduled there. Uh, and then pointing out that uh, next week is our last Sunday with Sunday School. And after that, uh, on the, tr the following week, so in two weeks from now, May 26th, we will begin our summer worship service schedule. So the worship service will be at 9.30 and there will be no Sunday School. So mark your calendars. Two weeks from now will be our service time change and, um, and end of Sunday School. So uh, any other announcements to share? Any other announcements? Okay. All right, well, let's open then with our call to worship from Psalm 102 and 4. Serve the Lord with gladness, come before him with singing, enter his gates with thanksgiving, and his courts with praise. Give thanks to him, bless his name. Please bow your heads, we'll open with prayer. Dear Lord, thank you uh, for this day. We can gather together as your people. Uh, to worship you, to seek you, uh, to receive grace from your Son, Jesus, our Savior. And pray that you would strengthen our faith and our knowledge of you. We pray this in Jesus' name. Amen. Okay, uh, we are. it's the second Sunday of the month, so we're going to open with a praise song. And then uh, the middle of the service, you'll see our usual, we'll have our hymn sing time later. So. And for our opening song, we're going to honor our mothers here on Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day to all our mothers. And uh, Kim, I will let you start. Her strength and her dignity clothe her with beauty. In works of her hands, she excels. A heart of compassion, she turns to the needy. In service to others, she gives of herself. She will be called blessed by her sons and her daughters, precious to the Father, are those who seek His ways. She will be called blessed. morning to see her household. She looks toward the future with joy. She teaches her children to lessons of kindness and shares with them wisdom the world cannot destroy.
Hunter's going to come forward for the scripture reading and invite you all to stand. Good morning and happy Mother's Day to all you mothers. The Old Testament lesson is from Leviticus 19, verses 1 through 3. And the Lord spoke to Moses, saying, Speak to all the congregation of the people of Israel and say to them, You shall be holy, for I, the Lord your God, am holy. Every one of you shall receive, shall revere his mother and his father, and you shall keep my Sabbaths. I am the Lord your God. The epistle lesson is from Ephesians 4, 32, and then chapter 5, 1 and 2. Be kind to one another, tender-hearted, forgiving one another, as God in Christ forgave you. Therefore, be imitators of God as beloved children, and walk in love as Christ loved us and gave himself up for us a fragrant offering and sacrifice to God. Here ends the reading. You may be seated. Please bow your heads in silence and take a moment of a personal confession of sin. Almighty God, our Heavenly Father, has had mercy upon us and has given his only Son to die for us and for his sake forgives us all our sins. To those who believe on his name, he gives power to become sons of God and has promised them his Holy Spirit. He who believes and is baptized shall be saved. Grant this, Lord, to us all. Amen. Okay, so now we come to our time of the service when we share our prayer requests and needs or praises, answered prayers with each other. So is there uh, an answer to prayer to share today or a, or a further request? 